Hey guys, this is Matt Beck from freesaloneducation.com. I'm here with a review of the Amica blow dryer you guys have seen on splitting hairs. We're gonna start off, the look of it is cool. Um, I think that that's what's gonna attract you the most. Amica does a great job at creating eye-catching products, but what is the quality like? That's the big question, because most of the time when things look cool or have a different look to them, there might not be the greatest quality. So uh, right off the bat, you could tell that Amica has put a lot of thought into their tools and added a lot of features that are great for professional stylists. The first thing is the positive and negative ion button. So not only, most, most blow dryers just have ions, they don't tell you whether they're positive or negative, or some went with just negative ions. The great thing about having a positive and negative, they have a different reaction to the cuticle of the hair. So the positive is going to help open up the cuticle. And what that, the great thing about that and what it's gonna do for the hair and for the quality of the hair is that's gonna allow you to, any treatments, talk about putting oils in or different moisturizers into the hair. If you use your positive ion, it's gonna help open the cuticle and then you can get those nutrients into the hair shaft. And then you can use the negative ion, switch that and seal the cuticle down. So it works really well for treatments. That's one of the great things I like about this blow dryer. It has three temperature settings, so that's cool. Uh, most blow dryers only have two. Um, there's two speeds, so um, let's just show how this thing kind of fires up real quick. So it's a powerful blow dryer. This is one of those blow dryers, it's not super quiet, but it has a lot of power. So let's look at, we fire it up. You can see this light that comes on, that changes with whether it's a positive or negative ion. So I like that feature as well, so I'll turn it on. So you can see the different color shift. So green means negative, uh, blue means positive. So that's kind of a cool feature. I like when blow dryers light up, it's cool for the clients and everything, and it's just uh, a neat add-on feature. The cool shot button is real easy. You just push it in, you hold it in, to get it to cool the hair down, uh, which I like because sometimes when you have to snap the button in, it's not that handy when you're uh, trying to blow dry hair. So um, the other thing is it's 1875 watts. So 1875, um, that's a pretty standard you know, wattage. So I don't see anything real different with that. Um, sometimes they get up in the 2000s. I think that's just too much. And you're gonna be blowing um, your breakers in the salon constantly. Um, the other thing about that is they say it dries the hair 70% faster. Who knows what that means? I still, every company claims to blow dry faster. Um, I don't know if it's 70% faster than somebody just blowing on the hair. I don't know, but 70% faster is pretty cool. Um, and I'm sure it does because of the negative ions and the, uh, the power of the dryer. Um, it has an AC motor instead of a DC motor. I'm not really sure exactly the big difference in that, but I know that AC is gonna last a lot longer. They're saying that this will last three times longer than a regular DC blow dryer. Um, it's got, a, they say it has a silent fan blade. This was the only thing that I didn't quite understand because it's a, it's a little bit loud, but I don't personally care on the salon. For, for me, I would rather have the power. Um, it doesn't need to be super quiet. No blow dryer is really that quiet. Um, but the fan actually, the fan doesn't make a lot of noise, but the power of the air is where you get the sound. So um, I just don't want you guys to be fooled and think that it's a super quiet blow dryer because it's really not. But you know what? We're professionals. We got to get the job done and, uh, and it works really well. The last thing about this blow dryer that I really like is it has a dual housing. And what that is, is basically there's a housing within the housing. So it's protecting the inside of the dryer. So if you drop it, um, or anything like that, it's not gonna break. It's, it's meant to be for professionals. So it's got a cool look to it and it's for professional stylists. So I hope that this review helps you guys make a decision on a blow dryer. Um, I think Amika's cool. Their marketing is cool. Follow them uh, on Instagram. I think it's Love Amika. Um, and you can check out some more of their products. We have some more to review later on in other videos. So thank you guys for watching this video. We'll see you next time. Thanks guys.